Hello everyone, I'm Defush 3004 Welcome back to Planet Crafter. Thank you for taking the time to hang out with me. I always enjoy hanging out with you. It's good to have you back at the channel. Uh, real quick, I wanted to look at something and it looks like we're getting ready to go over to the next stage, which is Moss. We're at 94% there. So we're doing really good there. That is really, really good. I'm happy for that. That means that we're going to be getting some Moss, which means everything out there should begin turning like a green along some places i just don't know exactly where and i wanted to show you something too it looks like we have a little bit of water over here in this area and i think that's pretty interesting i don't know why we have water here but we do so that's kind of cool i don't know if it's gonna grow anymore or become any bigger or whatever but we do have water there and one of the very important thing to know is the last time we launched a uranium rocket, a rocket that would help uranium um, asteroids or whatever come down, and a bunch started coming down right away. That's what it does. One time. And then there won't be any more after that. You have to launch up another rocket and a bunch more uranium will come raining down. And the same thing with iridium. So I thought it would just keep on raining uranium, but it is not going to do that. We have to launch a rocket to make it do that. And so that was something that happened. And after a while, they will disappear. There was some out here well, upon editing, editing my last video. I noticed there was some out here, but I didn't really see it because I was focused on doing other things and after a little bit it despawns and then you just don't get it so do be aware of that and if you're ever playing this just make sure that you do get stuff like that and make sure that you are on top of your game because obviously I am not so there is that all right before we go over to the next stage which is coming up here really 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 quick what I want to do is go look at something in here that my friend was telling me about. I haven't looked at this constructor for a while besides making oxygen. And you can see there's quite a few things in here and different things like that. One of the things that we can make is microchip, microchip, microchip construction menu filter. Hides lower tiers of objects from the construction menu. I need one more magnesium. Forgot to grab one. I thought I did, but I did not. So now we got to go grab a magnesium. All right. So now we have that. I did make a bit more of the super alloy just because we are going to be needing it again. And I want to go see. Let's go do the microchip construction menu filter. All right. So now we got that. That'll go in one of these two slots. So let's just go ahead and do that. Now, when we go to Q, it is only going to show the things that are the top things. So we don't see the lower things of the nuclear reactors. We can take that out to show the lower things, and that's good. That's not going to hurt anything. But if we just want to find that higher tier stuff, it's only going to show the higher tier stuff. And I think that's actually pretty awesome, too. All right, we're about ready to go over to the next level. We're going to be getting some extra stuff when that happens. I'm really excited for that, so that sounds like a lot of fun. These things are coming up really quick, and it looks like we're also getting some pretty good stuff in here, too. So at 35, we're going to have the food grower tier 2. We're at 12, so we're getting about almost halfway there. Not quite. Somewhat close. We have tree bark in here. I'm pretty sure that we would have to have a couple. So that just makes tree bark every now and then. We're going to need that for other things. Hopefully we can begin getting some trees coming in here soon. That would be really good. And I'm going to need one more thing. Actually a couple of more things. Let me go grab one more piece of uranium and a iridium rod. We're probably going to go make another rocket for uranium here soon. But maybe not right away because I do want to make sure I go gather it all up. I just want to make sure that I have everything ready. What I can do is probably... Wait, why, why do I have two iridium rods apparently i already had one on me okay that's interesting i did not know that i did that we are getting so close to the next level let's also go see about taking these and see if we can open up anything so let's go to here decode a blueprint okay no more blueprints to de oops, to decode for now so we can't do anything of those let's just go ahead and put this stuff in there for right now and then we will do more of this later i want to make sure to have this stuff available 
and we're getting ready to go over to the next level, which is going to be whatever it is when we start getting the moss. We're so very, very close. I'm just going to hang out. We're going to see what we're going to get. I'd like to get some more heaters and different things going and different, you know, things like that. But I also want to go over and start doing something because I have heard that in a ship piece, there is a deconstructible wall that you can find and there should be something behind the wall i don't know we're gonna have to go see and we're just gonna probably start over there in that ship because it's kind of fairly close to us and we can just go in there and see what the heck may be in there we have been through the other ship over there the one up by the rock and we did go through that one with our deconstructor thing with the x and we didn't find anything so I want to go see about that. All right, we're going to the next level. Here it comes. Bing. All right. We got an achievement. Greenery. New blueprint received. Screen biomass. Let's go to Q. Okay, screen biomass. So we need another iron, a silicon, and an aluminum. I don't know where we're going to put it, but I'm sure we can figure it out. Let's go grab a silicon and an aluminum aluminium and un el silicon okay cool now let's go see about the screen q how big is that screen i really don't know it isn't overly huge but it looks like it will probably go on the wall and that is cool i don't know that it will i'm thinking it will but it may not food level low me go see if he's gonna go on the wall or anything okay cool he will go on the wall since it is a biomass thing let's go see if there's anywhere that we could put this bad boy let's go see since we do have the biomass stuff well we can put it on one of these walls since we're all right i'll be there in just a minute okay can you hold on please let me turn this guy around like that and let's put him there we go, something right about like that. All right, cool. So now we can see the biomass really good. Oh, look, aminals. Sweet, there are aminals that we will get at some point in time. Let's gather up some food. Oops, let's eat some food. Let's go ahead and have a squash. We'll have a water. We'll go and put the other food in here that we just don't need to carry with us right now. And we'll put some extra food in here that we probably just don't need. I am just going to go and drop two of those. We'll keep some of that. Let's go out. Let's get some water. And then we're going to go do a little bit of switching and go see what we can find. What I might do is also make up a couple more oxygens. It probably won't hurt. So let me go do that real quick. And then we'll go over to that ship. All right. I did make some oxygen. I have five food, five oxygen, and five water. That should be enough to help us out, or at least so I would think. So let's go over there to that ship. We have a little place that we can get in, and we're going to go explore in there and just see what the heck we can find, wherever it is that we can find what we can find, and hopefully there will be some good stuff. I don't know. So we're just going to have to go and see. Let me get over to there, get in that little place, get our oxygen refilled so we can go into there really well. I don't want to use the oxygen if I don't have to, just in case we need it for something else later on. Okay, it looks like we do have quite a bit of stuff in here to get out, so we'll be working on that soon. All right, let's go. Let's go here. Let's go and take out our deconstructor later. And let's walk around and let's go see if there's anything that we can find. It's going to be deconstructible. Doesn't look like anything so far. Pretty sure there's not going to be anything up here. And it doesn't... Whoa. Okay, I guess we're going to fall back down. Well, let's go back here. Let's turn on our light. And let's go see if there's anything deconstructible back here. Okay. 
doesn't look like anything here while we're here let's just uh let's go ahead and go down and we will use our deconstructor later and see what we can find if we see any chests of course we're gonna have to go and see about them Boy, that wind is really really loud Okay, so far nothing, but I don't know if we haven't just found the right area or what. Let's go, oh yeah, I forgot about all the iron. Let me go ahead and deconstruct that. We will take that, and then we will deconstruct that. I totally forgot all about that iron. Now well, while we have the inventory space, okay, there is nothing here. Let's get out of here. So that means there was nothing back in this area besides a chest that was long since forgotten. I am going to go replenish my oxygen and then we'll go back in and do some more searching. All right, I'm back in the ship. Let's go ahead and go this way this time and let's go through here. I do believe maybe we were here, maybe we weren't. I don't remember. Okay, I don't believe that we were here. There's still some doors that I just don't know anything about, so we're going to have to go see about that. Okay, so far I'm not noticing anything that says, you know, we, we've seen these walls before. Let's say, you know, deconstruct, tear them down. We've seen them in some of the other ships that we've been in. So, so far I'm not really seeing anything that says anything about a deconstructed wall. Okay, let's go ahead and tear that guy apart. Okay, all those little dots out there or beacons is was was throwing me off for a minute. Okay, well, we don't know anything there. Let's go up here and let's go ahead and see if there's anything up here. It doesn't look like it so far. And let's go searching and just go see if we can find whatever it is that we are looking for. Hey, look at that right there. Deconstruct racks, huh? Ooh, hey. Nice. So there's a little hidden area back here, huh? Oh, we need these. We need these. We need. Oh, we need that too. Sweet. And we're going to take that. And we're going to take that. Um, Is there any... Oh, tree seed. We're going to take that. At. We're going to take that. At. We found a tree seed and a... The hey zeolite. We're gonna take those. We're gonna take that. Fertilizer tier two. I've never seen a tier two. Nice. Okay, cool. And what's in there? Another rocket engine fertilizer. Blueprint fertilizer tier. No, oh, that's tier one. Osmium. You know what? We might as well just go ahead and let's take that let's go see if there is another good seed there is another good tusca since those ones do so much more cool so we found a place that we can take out and now you know where that place is too all right just go to the apparently the ladder that goes up and then you can find that now so all i gotta do is get out of here safely Let's go this way and out through here, out through here, up around the corner, out this way, and get over to that place. Okay. Cool. Well, that was just pretty awesome, man. I do got to say, I did put all the iron in here, so we have that. I want to try to get the last of that stuff, so maybe what I should do is... Well, we have four fertilizers. That's crazy. Oh, five five fertilizers that's nuts i don't think i've seen that much fertilizer in one place we're gonna go back and we're just gonna go see if we can get anything else out of there since we do have you know th that door open let's go gather the rest of that stuff and get that out of there so if you know where it is now it's not going to be too terribly hard to get to Okay, there we go. Easy peasy. Let's take that. Destruct that. Let's take that. Destruct that. And let's take that. And then we'll destruct that. Alright, cool. This place is now done. This ship is knocked outed. Alright, that's awesome.
Gotta find the way down now, man. I lost my way. Okay. Let's shut off our light. I don't want anything from there. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take the stuff that we really do need, like these. And I think that maybe we should take those. The Osmond, Osmium we can take, and I'm not going to get too worried about much of anything else. I definitely want those Uranium Rods. Those things are worth a lot just because they cost so much to make. All right, let's get back over there, and let's go see if there is anything else that may be coming up for us. I really don't know, but we're just going to have to go find out. All right, made it back home. Let's go see about putting some of this stuff away. We do know we have uranium up top because last time we had quite a bit of stuff. And since I was making so much, so much super alloy, I do remember seeing that up here. So that's good. Now we have the rocket engine. And I think we need one rocket engine and that stuff down there. And... Um, I'm trying to remember. We should go see about making some more uranium I rain down on us. But I think for right now, I'm just going to wait. And we will do that soon. I just want to make sure that we do have everything that we need. And that should be all of this stuff here. It was, I think, three of those. I don't remember what it was. But I do know there's a rocket engine. And I think it was everything there. If I remember correctly, but I could be wrong about that. Okay, cool. So now we have that. What all do we have on us that we just don't need to carry? Let's go put some seeds away and get some other things done like that. Right now, since we do have the moss coming, it looks like the next stage is going to be flora. Of course, we're only 4.3% in, so there is quite a ways to go. And that sounds pretty awesome. I guess we'll be having a bunch more plants and stuff coming in. What the heck? Look at that. Look at all the moss everywhere. Look at that moss up there. That's crazy. That's awesome. This is kind of cool, actually. It's green. It's greeny, greeny, green. All right. There's one more thing that I want to do. And my friend told me about it. But I have heard about it, but I don't know where it is. There is another area that we need to go see about destructing, but I don't know where it is. He just said that it is near here, where this thing is. So that it is near here. That's all that he told me. So, um, said that the, there is a rock wall that can be destroyed. That's all I know. So, my thought is, let's go do some looking to see if there is a way that we can figure out what it is and where it is. And he said it was pretty sure that it would be underwater by now, and that's why I'm underwater. Because that's what I was told. And I guess we're just going to have to kind of do some looking to see if there is. He just said it's near there, and that's all that I am aware of. I don't even know because I have not done any looking yet. So I guess we just need to go find out. Okay. It's not there. Let's go see. Hopefully it won't be, like, up here or anything, but it could be. I don't... Whoa. Okay, we went through that rock. How do you like that? Almost got stuck, too. All right. Well, I'm just going to stay down in the water a little bit and just go see if there is anything that I can find. Because there could be things here that I don't know anything about. And if there is, then I guess that we will find them and we will go see... There are things that we can get into, but I just don't know if there will be. I'm not going to pick up any ore or anything right now. I just don't see a need for that. Just trying to make sure that I do look at things just to know because, you know, you never know. Let's go see. It could be over here along this wall. I don't know. 
This is very interesting, I do gotta say. I have heard about some hidden things in the game, but I don't know where any of those hidden things are other than they are hidden and finding them is a challenge. Not noticing anything that says to tear down a wall yet, so, you know. I'm sure we'll see something, or so I would think, but, you know, I have been wrong before. And I probably will be wrong again. But I don't even know how high up it's supposed to be. That's the whole thing, is I just don't know. Okay, I did find what I was looking for, and um, I don't know where it is exactly. So let me just go up and see if I can figure out where we are. About there. Drink some water. I need some food here in a minute. Okay, so it's across from that big ship, and there's an area right down here. There's this thing right there, and I would have never even noticed that if it wasn't for him saying something. Okay. Let's see. Ooh, hey. Look at that. There's a dead person there. Read message. You sent me here to die. You knew it wasn't possible. You don't even care. All you care about is profit and colonization. Whoever thought this was a good idea, go to hell. The burning place. The plan was never forgiveness. Be cursed, Sentinel Corporations. Yodi Zyodan. Okay. Well. Oh, wow. Holy moly. There's a lot of stuff there, man. We got to go dump this stuff and come back to here. That's crazy. That's a lot of stuff. Well, now you know where it is. And... Just to make sure, I'm going to go up top here, and we can just really go see. Okay, so now you know where it is. It's basically straight across from that ship. There is a alleyway right there that goes up to where there is Iridium. And over here is the other ship. Okay, cool. So there's a nice little hidey place. I have heard about it. People have talked about it on the forums, and there are videos out there about it. I didn't watch it because I didn't want to know where it was, but they said that there was a place to find things, and now I know that there is. That's awesome. I didn't even know that was stuff was there. Now we have some rocket engines that we can work with. That's so cool. That is actually going to help out quite a bit. It looks like another iridium rod and zeolite and all kinds of seed nolna okay some more food seeds and everything else and i did make another locker over here with some food seeds in it so we do have that and now we have even more that's so cool so we can actually set up a huge farm if we want to all right let's go see about a place to put rockets we got to put this in here we do have another rocket engine and then of course we have oh we have that we don't have any more places for that so let's just go ahead and transfer some stuff around and go see what we can do what i've done is i have moved this locker here that has ice in it and i put in a locker here i originally had it slid up all the way against that wall but then this thing was buried and i couldn't see what that was going to say so i went ahead and just pulled it out a little bit we can always move it over if need be to put another you know big locker over here if we want to but i think that should work for right now what i'm going to do is just put in a whole bunch of that we already have algae like that and so i let me see okay good iridium and i want to make sure to get whatever algae that we have into like good places so we can get that stuff really easy and it looks like we're also gonna have to put some more of this quartz away so we have all of that that's crazy that's a lot of stuff that is working out good we are massing a lot of stuff, but I have a feeling we're going to be going through a lot of it as well. So there is that. All right. 
Cool, so we got some things going on. How are we doing? 7%. It looks like biomass is up 15. We, oops, we could go see about doing another flower spreader, which would help because we haven't done any of those. We have the tier one flower spreader also. We got that open last time, but we can't see it because we put in that thing that hides the lower tier stuff. So let's go here to tab. Let's take out this and then let's go back to Q and let's go see about the lower uh, where is it at? Okay, flower spreader. I thought that we can make the flower spreader tier one. I don't see the tier one anywhere. That's interesting because there's that tier two. There's a, oh, there, okay, there it is. Okay, we need three water, super alloy, magnesium fertilizer. Let's make a level one this time just so that we do have that. Okay, magnesium and water and super alloy. Magnesium is over here. Let's go grab a super alloy. Cool. And three waters. We might as well just go outside and grab those. We are going to be getting low here soon anyway. So, you know, it isn't going to hurt. And then we're going to grab a seed. And we're probably just going to find one that we have not done yet. So I do believe that we have golden flowers. These are not golden flowers, but they are Tuskas. Okay, so we know we have the Tuskas. And this one over here should be the golden flower right here. If I remember correctly, golden seed. Okay, good. And let's go see about this one. This one is the Nolna. So let's go find another seed of a flower that we can use and we're going to set one more up somewhere we're going to figure this out we got to go up to here and let's find a good one we could do a pestera i don't believe we have a pestera we did a nona and we can't do the lerma and we can also do a shinga we don't have a shinga but we do have everything else why am i going that way don't ask questions i don't know because i just got all confused all right, let's go out here. Let's do one out here. How does that sound? All right, Q. Let's do a flower spreader. And let's put him right there. All right, so now we have that. Sweet. So now we have a pestera that'll be coming, and there will be some flowers growing here really, really soon. That's awesome. All right, now I'm going to put this guy back in so we can only see the top tier stuff. Let's go see how much energy we have. We're going to have to get some more food anyway, and we can go check all of that stuff. So now you know about that place. We need to go down and get rid of that uh, crate, but we can do that in a little bit. Let me go gather the food, and then we may head down there. And now we found some good secrets, and I think that's really, really cool. I do like it when we find secrets. I do like doing that kind of thing. It's always fun, and it's always exciting. All right, let's drop that, and then we're going to go and drop one more bean, so that way we have a couple of squash and some beans. We only have two oxygen left, but I do know that I did drop some in here, so we'll take at least three oxygen with us. Okay, so cool, so cool, so cool. Now, um, we got to go back down there, and let's go see. Doggone, would you stop? Thank you. Doggone phone, it wouldn't let me stop. I wasn't pressing dismiss fast enough. All right, let's go back down to the water. Let's go get that crate. And I think that we've actually, we haven't done anything super exciting, but it's been exciting enough finding the hidden stuff and... I think that was really cool. I have heard about the one in the big ship over there. I just really wasn't too sure. So now we know. Let's go down about here. It's right in here. There it is right there. Let's turn on our light. Okay. I don't know who this is, but they look like another person that was sent here to die. Which is very interesting. Okay. Now we know all about that. So that's sad. But it is 
what it is and you know this game has a lot of hidden things and i find that very very interesting the, you can glitch right through the wall there so you don't have to worry about you know getting stuck because you just go through it like this way and that's pretty cool too we can still get stuff from under the water here just so you know so if you are interested in doing it you can why am i not i am not flying there we go i cannot fly for some reason Okay, and I think that my friend said that there's something back in here. Uh, I know what it was. We can get Iridium if we set up a place back here. Oh, wow, look. Quite a bit of stuff back here. We can mine Iridium back here. So what I might do is go see about setting up one of those things. And we can hopefully get some good iridium a extractor. Let me go find out what that's going to take. And we'll set one up back there. I believe that I have everything that I need. Let's go back here. And let's go set up a ore extractor back here. And hopefully we'll be able to get some good um, iridium. Because, you know, we could always use that. What I'm going to do is probably set it down right back over here. Let's put it right there. I think that would be good enough, I hope. All right, let's put that down right. Let me turn that like, yeah, let's turn it towards us. I think that'd be good right there. Okay, cool. Look, iridium, we're gonna get iridium. We're gonna get iridium. Now we have some iridium, at least we will soon. All right, oops. Now we can really begin getting some good resources and do some good stuff here. That's awesome. So now we don't really need to worry about sending up iridium rockets because we will have all the iridium that we need. And soon, hopefully, we'll be able to also get as much uranium as we want. Just depends if we can find a place to mine some at and if it will let us do that. I don't know if it will or not, but we're just going to have to wait and see. So we did some pretty good stuff. We found some secrets, and I think that's really awesome, like I said. And if you enjoyed it, drop a like on the video. If you like what you see here, consider subscribing. That would be awesome if you could do that. That would really help out the channel a lot. And I have some other games that I am probably am going to be going to here really soon. And hopefully... Just keep watching and keep your eye on the channel for that. Some new games are coming out. And some games that I have done before are coming out in full release. And that sounds really exciting. So do keep watch out for that. Let me get back to the base and I'll talk to you then. So it looks like we have some good flowers growing. That's really cool. These are those nice flowers. These are those Pesteras, so I think that really looks good. It sounds like it's raining, but I don't see any rain, so I don't know if it's just raining super hard or it's hailing or what. I have no idea, but man, that's noisy. Holy moly. So you can see what all we got. Let's go see how much energy we have real quick. 127 kilowatts or yeah 127 kilowatts that's pretty awesome so now we have that and we have some other stuff going on this is planet crafter thank you for joining me here and if you enjoyed the episode like i said drop a like on the video and we will talk to you next time bye bye